Hi, this is Kavita Suresh Kumar and in this video I am going to demonstrate how to update multiple records in ServiceNow. I have logged into my ServiceNow instance. Now let us see how to update multiple records. So I am going to use the incidents list. Right. So currently we are in the incidents list view. Okay. And we could see right so that the state it has been started based on the state and I have multiple records in the new state right okay so now if i wanted to update the first three incidents right i wanted to change the state of the first three incidents i wanted to change only the state field so in that case i'm just going to select that particular uh, state field right and then using the shift i'll be able to select the other records right so now the three records have been selected so now if i wanted to change the state right so it says three rows will be updated okay so I'm going to change the state to in progress and then I'm going to click save, right? So in this way, if you wanted to update only one particular field value, right? For but, but for multiple records, you'll be able to do that here. Okay, so the other way of doing it here is, right? You'll be able to select. So now I wanted to change the remaining three, but I wanted to put it in a different state. Okay, I have selected the three rows, right? So then I'm going to select right click, right? I'm going to say update selector, okay? So now I'm going to change the state to on hold, right? And then I'm going to give the reason awaiting change. Okay, then I'm going to click update. Okay, so now let us go and confirm that. Okay, okay, so we could see, right, updated. These are the three records which we updated now. Okay, and in case, right, so uh, the other option is, right, so it is like, see, now we selected the rows or you'll be able to just apply a filter, right? See, for example, right? So you'll be just able to right click and then you can show the show matching. So now it has filtered only the uh, records which are in the on state. So then you can just right click and say update all. Right. So in this case, it is going to update all the uh, incidents, right, which are currently in the on hold state. OK, in this demo, we have seen how to update multiple records in service. Now, if you like this demo, please do like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching the demo.